Well, last night I got to finally see The Life of Pi. It's a beautiful movie. A few parts may be kind of cringe. A lot of good humor parts. Some really interesting moments. And yes, it does have a religious overtone, but I wonder how many other people that are atheists caught. I mean, this is a big spoiler. The ending that is supposed to prove God, I think is actually an atheist message. I don't know if that was the intention, but that's what I get from it. The ending has, you know, you're told two stories of what happened to him while after the shipwreck. And you ask, which one do you prefer? Of course, everybody prefers the, the one the movie is based upon. You know, this beautiful, wonderful journey, some horror, some d death, but it was still exciting over the more realistic ending story. And he says, as is with God. Now, the impre no, the, what I got implied from that is people choose God because it's better to believe most a lot of theists like to say that there's a God loving God that there's hope after death that the universe has hope meaning meant to believe that it hell has nothing but I, I think he's arguing for atheism here even if unintentionally because basically what he's saying is there's truth and then there's non-truth and people prefer to lie over truth because that's what they want. That's what is better. That's why people believe in God. And that's how you prove God. Because nobody wants the reality of the situation. You know, frankly, I prefer <laughs> the, the story from the movie. Even though I realize that's impossible. You know? And frankly, part of me wouldn't mind certain gods, not the Christian, Muslim, God, you know, but maybe some of the more animistic gods, you know, the nature gods and whatnot. They're a little more up my alley. But they're not, but there's no evidence for them. They're not real, as far as I can tell. And the time to believe in something is when you have good evidence. And when you feel that evidence is strong enough. I just don't feel that way. I'm not going to waste time believing in something that I can't be sure is real. That's just wasting my time. So, for those who saw it, or plan to see it, what do you guys think? Do you think this is actually more of an atheist ending, or what? Comment down below, let me know your thoughts.